You ready to go get some picks? Ready to go. All right, well, let's go over the WISE method again before we go out. Okay. So, WISE, what does it mean? White balance, ISO, uh -huh. scene selection, and exposure compensation. Yep, that's right. To take better control of your images, use the WISE method of setting your point and shoot camera. Since image icons will vary by camera brand, you should read your manual to make the most of the WISE method and be able to find all these settings in your camera. So W, that's white balance. And you want to set your white balance to whatever's going on in your scene. So if you're outdoors and it's sunny, you probably want to set it to the sunny icon. Or if it's cloudy, you might want to set it to cloudy. Here's an example of how white balance can affect your images. We chose the cloudy icon for this shot to give just a bit of warmth to the photo. So I, ISO. ISO is the film speed and the sensor sensitivity. And what that means is the lower the setting, the better quality. The higher setting, a little bit more noisy, a little bit more image grain. Here are examples of how ISO affects the image. Although, you may not notice it at first in the image. Once you zoom in or enlarge the photo, you can really see the noise. As you can see, ISO 800 will give you a faster shutter speed, but also more image noise. S is your scene selection. Scene selection is used to change your exposure and depth of field. In many cameras, choosing a scene will put the camera into auto ISO mode. If you want more control of the ISO, set your camera to program mode. Here's an example of depth of field. By using the portrait setting to focus on the foreground subject, the background will appear blurry, whereas the landscape setting will render the entire scene in focus. So E, exposure compensation. That is the, the minus and the plus sign in your camera, and that controls the light. So what that does is if you're composing an image and it looks too dark, you might want to add light. So you would want to use the plus sign. So if you remember, minus is take away light, and the plus is adding light. Here's an example of how changing exposure compensation affects the image. Alright, so that's wise. So you ready to go get some shots? Ready to go. Alright, let's do it.